Hello to all my friends on FB. How are you feeling today? This is Will Yap. In the next couple of days, I'll be doing a series of FB live videos talking about leaders in the network marketing industry in Malaysia, Singapore, Hong Kong, and also in Brunei. Probably you may know myself and, and my wife, we have been building our network marketing business since early 2018 and the company we partner with is called BE International. Okay, BE International is a, is a Malaysian-based company and one of its top-selling product is the Alora Pants with Kodenshi from Japan. Uh, probably you heard of it. And then in, in our business, I've also created an online brand for my wife, uh, which is Mami Lin. If you, if you Google the name Mami Lin Malaysia and you, you'll find our website. Lah. It's actually Mami Lin Com. In the B business, uh, just like with all the other network marketing uh, business opportunity, there are certain rankings and the highest ranking in BE is called the Royal Crown Council Ambassador. It's a big word, but in short, it's, it's uh, called RCCA. Okay, how do you achieve uh, the ranking of RCCA in BE? Okay, the criteria for you to reach RCCA is to receive 1 million ringgit. Uh, the commission or bonus from the company within a period of 24 months in two years huh? and so you know RCCAs are they are successful leaders in the network marketing industry you may be wondering how many RCCAs are there in BE okay let me share you with, share with you some stats okay B International the company was set up at the end of year 2017 so uh, so until now, it's roughly about four and a half years old. And in that time frame, uh, the company has already produced 49, uh, 49 RCCAs. And you'll be surprised, uh, more than half the RCCAs from BE actually came out during the last two years, uh, during um, when Malaysia was under lockdown and during MCO. Okay, and uh, so you may be wondering, uh, who are these people reaching the ranking of RCCA? Okay, what are their background? Uh, that's the reason I want to do this uh, FB Live today. I want to share with you the story of one of the RCCAs. Okay, and uh, today I want to share the story of the RCCA. His name is called Chong Chi An, and in BE we refer to Chi An as the big brother. He's uh, someone quite famous uh, in the company. I remember, I remember the first time I met Chi An, uh, he looks like a very stern person and he doesn't talk much, he's very quiet. And later I, I found out why Chi An is such a quiet person and, and because, you know, he's an engineer, just like myself. You know, on, on uh, Facebook, I have a lot of friends who are engineers also. As engineer, you know, we, we like to think, we like to think, we like to solve problems and uh, we don't really like to talk much. Lah. And uh, surprisingly, when Chi An goes on stage to speak, he, he's like a different person. Okay, let me share with you a story. You know, the first time I, I actually saw Chi An speak on stage, uh, it was on the 5th of January, year 2017. I remember very clearly because that is the day uh, BE launched uh, one of their new products called Shuruto, and it was at the Sunway Convention Center. And Chi An went on stage, he actually spoke in Mandarin. But you know what? As he speak on stage, uh, he was confident, he was very persuasive, and he was very charismatic. charismatic. And that's, that's why I'm very, very impressed with him. And Chi An also has a very impressive uh, story. He actually became a millionaire at a very young, very young age of 30 years old. Most of us, when we are uh, 30, we just graduated from university and started working. And no, and Chi An did not strike the lottery uh, uh, by becoming uh, become a millionaire, he did not strike the lottery. According to Ji An, it was a decision that he made. Uh, and Ji An's parents, you know, they, were, they were just farmers, uh, normal farmers, and they wanted, uh, they wanted their children to study hard for a better life. You know, what parents doesn't, right? And Ji An, uh, he has three other siblings who are all graduates from local universities. And Ji An's parents actually work hard to finance all of their studies. Okay, when Chi An went, uh, graduated from, from UTM, he decided, uh, the word is he decided to take a gap year to pursue a career in the MLM industry. 
I don't know if you've done it before. After you graduated, uh, you take one or two years off just to do the things that you wanted to do before you start working. Lah. Being a good son, Chian, he wanted to become a successful research and development engineer so that he could give his parents a better life. But he figured if MLM could speed up his success, why not give it a try? Well, that was his thought process. It's very clever. From the time Chi'an decided to take a gap year to pursue a career in MLM industry, it has now been, been more than 20 years, uh, two decades already, and he has achieved great success uh, in his business journey. I want to quote Chi'an from an article I, I read about him. Uh, he said, I quote, uh, the MLM business has given us the opportunity to learn and to improve ourselves continuously. No matter how successful we are, we are always solving our downlines problem. We are growing too. As we grow stronger, our downlines grow too." End quote. Well, this is the story of RCCA Chong Chi An, a quiet engineer who has big dreams to make a difference. That's all I wanted to share today. If you like this video, please give it a like or give it a heart. And if you have friends who are engineers and they are, they are thinking of starting their own business, uh, share this video with them, uh, probably it might help. Uh. And if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to put it in the comment section and I will answer them. That's all I, I want to share today. This is William signing off. Bye.